Hello, welcome to Lenser Training. This tutorial shows how to insert the Axis Basic Control Function Block and its visualization template. In this example, a project named PLC Base Motion PRG is opened. The controller 3200C serves as PLC device. The project tree includes three axes, which are named Axis Z, Axis Y, and Axis X. In this example, Axis Z will be programmed by using the Axis Basic Control Function Block. The Axis Basic Control Function Block will be used to control an axis via the PLC Function Block and its visualization. In this program, the Function Block Editor is used. In order to run the axis by using the Axis Basic Control Function Block, Call the Axis Basic Control function block in the function block editor. Go to Toolbox, drag an empty box and drop it in the editor window. In the Text Search tab of the Input Assistant, type in the global name of the function block needed. In this example, type in Axis Basic Control. Select the function block and press the OK button to insert the function block in the editor window. An auto declaration window pops up for declaring the function block instance. Assign a suitable name to the instance. Press the OK button to accept the declaration. Now, the function block is successfully inserted in the program. The Axis Basic Control function block contains the following basic functions for the movement of an axis. Referencing, Manual Control, Endless Movement at Preset Velocity, Absolute Positioning and Relative Positioning. This function block additionally ensures handling of monitoring functions for hardware limit switches, software limits, and position lag error monitoring. The behavior of this function block is determined by the state machine. Only one state is active at any time. A changeover from one state to another is possible as soon as the condition for the transition has been fulfilled. This block needs an axis reference to control a specific axis. Here, assign axis Z by using the input assistant. This block has specific and dedicated inputs in order to execute several functions. Assign true to the Enable Internal Control Input Terminal of the Axis Basic Control Function Block to enable internal control of the Axis Basic Control Visualization Template. This block ensures easy diagnostics by its several outputs. Right-click on the Function Block and select Remove Unused FB Call Parameters. Select Application Go to Project, select Add Object and then Visualization. Name it Visu Axis Z and press the Add button to create a new visualization object. On the right hand side, there is Visualization Toolbox. At the bottom, there is a global search field which will help you to easily access various toolbox elements. Type in Axis Basic Control in the global search field of the Visualization Toolbox to search the Visualization Template from the available list of templates. Select the Axis Basic Control Template and drag it to the Editor window. A pop-up window for assigning parameters is opened. Choose an instance of the Axis Basic Control Function Block parameter by using the Input Assistant and press the OK button. Again, press the OK button for confirming the parameter assignment 
to the visualization template. Customize the frame size and position of the visualization template. The zoom can be adjusted if desired. The reference to the visualization element can be changed manually via the Reference tab of the Visualization Properties. Now, the Axis Basic Control Visualization template is successfully inserted in the project. Select Login. Confirm the warning message to download the project. Select Start to enable the controller. Value and status of input and output variable can be monitored in online mode. Internal control button in the visualization is only visible in the visualization when the Enable Internal Control Function block input is true. Press the Internal Control button to access different inputs of the visualization. The left-hand side consists of input parameters for the Axis Basic Control function block. The right-hand side shows motion and axis status. Switch to the PLC PRG tab to watch the online status of the function block. Select Create Boot Application for Devices from Lenser under Online in order to save the parameters permanently. Press Logout and save the project on your local drive.